Just waiting on the kids to get off the bus. This chair finally came, ordered it two weeks ago. I was hoping to go out and lay in the yard with the kids beforehand, but the coolest part about it though, you know, it goes flat too, but this. This, I think this is the best design for a chair right here, because now I can lay face down if I want to, and tend my back, <laughs> my butt, and my back and my legs. Uh, yeah, I think you can get it. All kinds of sites have it. It's outsourced, obviously. It says it holds 285 pounds. We shall see. I mean, I'm at 255, 260, so <laughs> it should be all right. But then if the kids climb on me and all that stuff. But yeah, it's nice. It's plastic, plastic type metal. But uh, yeah, good design. I really think it, uh, it was worth it. it. Came all together, folded up. We already did all the chores. Drank my protein shake. And uh, just waiting on the dudes to get here. Doing some laundry, all the usual stuff. Nice chair, best design I've seen yet. Cause uh, those, uh, the chairs where you're like floating, those are crap, dude. You can't lay on your stomach or anything. I like old fashioned chairs like this where you can lay flat and on your back. Waiting on you kids to get back on my head today, man. This is what you kids should be eating, your greens. Recycle kids. I'm guessing these are gonna die any day. It's been two days plus, so let's change these to avoid that. All right, done, done. Let's go charge these again. That just saved us five minutes because I know that's gonna happen. Yesterday's video was starting to import fast. That's good. Zebra took out the trash and the recycling already. Thank you, Zebra. Thank you, buddy. Good job, thank you. The exciting life of laundry, done. And here comes the first one. Ah, uh, it's Brody Boy, he gets to do his swing. Because we're staying in it, it's, it's cool out. It's like 69, 70. Come on, Brody boy. Thank you. Come on, buddy. You want to do the swing till brother gets here? Let me see. The bag. Thank you. Good job. How was school today, my man? Oh, we got to remember, Dad, you get hit in the head with this every time. He goes, Fuh -fuh. hi. Ah, oh, yeah, there's a big smile. You hungry? We're going to do that spaghetti again, man working you go going potty every morning now it's good hopefully you went at school today too all right he's gonna do his swing in here we're waiting on his brother and then we're gonna go in and everything's ready to go for you man your outfit's ready to go yeah maybe we'll get upstairs by 4 30 set a record here maybe you know what i can do i can go through your bag right here let's do that think outside the box dad save even more time did you eat your lunch most importantly no, you did not. Crap. How'd you do with school, though? But you know what? He'll eat his. He'll eat that anyway. The spaghetti. If he has no choice, he'll eat it. Cecil West, Cecil Dry. Chocolate milk, grapes. A little bit of pasta, they said. Okay. He just probably wasn't hungry. I don't know. I love it. Thank you. See, they know laminated. There's a little hanging out the edge there. It should be all right, though. It's beautiful. Beautiful, Brody. Happy Mother's Day this is for mommy from Brody. Oh, that's nice. We'll leave this stuff in there so mom can see it. What's this, Brody? Would you make the cover? <laughs> oh, this is cool. Uh, okay. I went inside. Where's this boy going? Look at him. Look at him. <laughs> hey, put the turtle back, man. What are you doing, bro? This is no. You try to sneak out to the pool. <laughs> Thank you. You too. Come on, we're gonna go inside. Okay, it's too. It's not swimming weather. Weather. Brody seems to think it is. Ooh, watch out for the tree. Can you uh get the turtle here? Can you help me get turtle? Here, get him. Bring him inside. We're not going outside though. We're going inside. No, no, we're going inside. Okay, we're just gonna slam him. Okay, inside. That's how he gets popped. Inside. Let's go inside. Come on, inside, Brody. I was in there for a few minutes, so I was trying to make his lunch. Go ahead, Beckham. Everything's ready for you, okay? Come on, let's go, baby boy. It's time. Come on, let's go. Come on. Good job. I know, he wanted to go outside. That's his way of saying, let's go, Dad. Even though I didn't use the turtle, what I know brother did. Yeah, did you see brother's projects? Look at that. He yeah, laminated. Look, he's got his own little yearbook there. Yes, Spring. Tea. Look, it's for mommy. Yes, tea. Say happy Mother's Day. We're not using tape anymore. Not yet. Let's just sit it around you play with this, okay? 
We will hang them up though, eventually. But to take this, hey, my man. Oh, you did take your shoes off. You're listening. Look at you. Hi, Brody. How you doing, my man? How was school, Beck? You have a good day? All right, while you're doing that, I'm going to go through your bag. Pancakes are in the microwave. Let's go here. Let's get you dressed first. Let's, let's get this over with. We're going to move as fast as we can today. Oh, run over there. Okay. Thank you. This is why it takes long, because you run off from me. Come on, let's go. Birdie, come on. It's time. Ah, oh, yeah, there he is. Running and running and stimming. You can stim as soon as you take these off. Oh. All right, Beckham's over there talking to the ants. Hi, ants. Good job, Brody. There you go. You all ready to go. You got your Mickey. Did you say hi to ants? Hi, ants. All right, your, your, your food's done here. Get your clothes on. Come on, I see them, but you're naked. Pancakes here, sir. Well, boing. Brody, I know you didn't eat this, but you ate it yesterday here, so we're going to do it again. But it was fresh cooked, so hopefully he'll eat it. I don't know. Beckham does his outfit all by himself. The remote's over there. Mickey has it. Or Brody, I should I say. <laughs> there you go, TV on. Hi, my man. <laughs> you happy boy. You happy goofy man. Yeah. Uh, happy man. Where's your ball at? It's your big ball. Big green ball. Good. I'm glad you're in a good mood after school. It makes me happy because I'm moving fast here. We're getting everything done. Nothing? No reaction? Yep. All right. Bro, did these get in the closet, man? Dirty. Dirty. Brody, this is your lunch for tomorrow. Sorry, it's not the greatest thing here. We got the tape. Your dinner for tonight. Daddy's defrosting a steak for tonight. I'm not eating that now. There's your lunch for tomorrow. Under the trays, I hid the gummy vitamins. So back, I'm gonna need them. There we go. Adjust the tray a little bit there. He's not gonna eat this. Look, the vitamin fairy left you something. Look. Look, Beckham, look, vitamins, pancakes. Let's go. Come on, kids. I mean, you can eat on your own time, but, uh, there, they just came out the microwave. There's your gummies. Take your vitamins, kids. Let's put this on the tray here. I'm going to wash these plates and put them back. There you go, Brody boy. They got your milk. Everything's there to go. Come on, Brody. I got to give them these because Beckham will eat them. You got your look. There's one more. Look. One more. Here. Take your vitamins, Brody. Yeah, I know you'll eat these right away. Go ahead. There you go. Your dinner's over there, okay? What you at, Pancake Boy? 104. All right, you're at a good level. Yeah, good job, Beckham. You're not getting high after school anymore. Oh, look who's joining us. Look, you got a feast over here, sir. I bless you. Oh, I bless you, Brody. Oh, round two of pancakes are done. We let them cool off, though. They are very hot. Beckham, how'd you do today, my man? Right to great and good. Some redirection I see already. Itsy bitsy spider. PB and J lemon blueberry cookies. Whoa, lemon blueberry cookies. They sound delicious. Laptop songs, drawing walks, tape. A man with the tape. Close the hangers things up. Matt. Gap. <laughs> Gap in his teeth, I don't know. Whoa, Beckham, look at this drawing, man. Now, we can't hang it up because you rip it up, son. I'm sorry. You don't seem to mind either, so we're just putting it away. Good job today. You had a good day. Oh, yeah, we already put batteries in there. Everything's ready to go. Oh, he's eating the spaghetti. I'll be damned. He's eating some grapes. This is good. How you feel? Is that what this is? How you feel? What is this, man? Mm, interesting, son. I love the drumming though by the Brody man. Round two of pancakes. Coming up. Round two. Hot, hot, hot. Hey! 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 Hot! Yeah, I told you they hot, bro. You didn't listen to me, man. Don't sue me, okay? All right, I see you're hassling those pancakes. It's time to do insulin, my man. Okay? Thanks, man. Thanks, man. Ready for it, ready? 
One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Well done, dude. Good job. Great game. Hurts, I know. Look at that face, man. Oh, boy. Now we're all just eating. And that's it, man. We're done. Look at that. That's some good time. Who is that? Brody. Yeah, it's Brody. He's handsome, huh? That one's nice. I got Brody. Well, Dennis Brody, that suits him. This is beautiful, though, Brody. You made all this, man. It's cool. This is yours. You made this beautiful flower for mommy. And that's for mommy, too. Make sure mommy sees this. And don't rip up that earbud or that uh, photo thing for him to, us to get photos of him. Where'd it go? I like the idea of magnets better than the tape thing all over the place because you know. Where are you gonna Where are you gonna put them? You just gonna play with them? I like when you just play with them. You set them up all over. He's stemming in. <laughs> Make sure mommy sees all that. Don't forget. Good job. Oh, it's a lot of asparagus. Almost full. Wanna eat it? Try. Eat your asparagus. Man. Come on. <laughs> its reaction is priceless to any green vegetable. Man. Come on, eat your asparagus. Just like your grandfather used to say. Come on, it's good for you. Hey ya! Hey ya! Whoa! 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 whoa. Yes, this is yes. <laughs> eat your asparagus, eat your asparagus. It's delicious. Everybody's doing it. It's what all the cool kids are doing. Here, Mickey, you want your asparagus? Mickey ate it. Mickey's gonna eat it. Yeah. Oh, asparagus and nunchucks. Whoa, 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 whoa. All right, all right. It's a waste. I, I like it. <laughs> Maestro. You want to finish this? You want your brother's? Because you didn't finish it. You want it? Yeah, I'm going to put it away to avoid it being dumped. Oh, the last one. Delicious. Now I get to have smelly urine. I already had a protein shake when I came up. Well, when I came downstairs, I say. And then I take your probiotic stat. I already took my vitamins. We're all good to go now. Lock, 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 all right, time for race car boom, let's go. I'm going upstairs to do race car boom. You're welcome to join me if you'd like there. I see a yawn already and I see six water cups are full here. Don't forget your water cup, Mr. Beckham. Oh, this thing's heavy and full. We're all ready to go in here. Now we just gotta go do uh, the usual. I cleaned up in here too a little. And it is all water from home, spitting it again. Like, let's go Monster Stink. Monster Zinc, volume 30. Fat and a blowing, nice and cool. Now, race car boom. Beckham's beautiful race car boom track. We're all ready to go, man. <clears throat> Taking it easy today. It's gonna rain in a moment here. You okay? What happened? Uh, you fell and dropped those? Cause I heard you said, oh. <laughs> oh yeah. Oh yeah. Did you go to make sure I put Monsters Inc on, right? I put it on already. I'm ahead of you, bro. I'm not behind today, man. Mommy will be really excited to see all that when he, when he comes in. Remember, that's from brother. She'll probably think it's from you. Well, now she'll see that, so she'll probably put two and two together. It does say Brody on there. Yeah, it does. <laughs> you stimming? Yeah, you get so excited when he builds. I love it. Good job, Beck. Well, this is yes. I love it, man. You still got some more Legos down there to work with. One day you're going to have an even bigger table down there with a big Lego thing set up. And Brody lets it all out on that trampoline. He bouncing. What's going on, brother? You good? You sound like you're having a meltdown. I can't tell. Can you go check on Brody with me real quick? Let's go say hi to Brody and see how he's doing. Hi, Brody. What's going on, man? Hi. 
You okay? Aw, oh, brother love. Good job, Beckham. Aw, oh, good job, Birdie. I saw a little peck there. Good job. Have noses? You okay? You okay? What's going on? What's going on, man? Well, you come join us if you want. Come hang out. You got Monsta Zinc, though. You don't want to. Don't you go in that closet. Hey! No, 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 no. You don't listen. Look at you immediately. This is no. I'm going to break your tablet. I'm going to break my foot off of your butt. Get out of here with that nonsense. Stop doing that. That's why I don't trust you and leave you in here. Come on. I'm trying to do race car boom. Let's go. Race car boom. Hey, this is no. Don't take his stuff, Brody. Don't. Don't take his stuff apart, Brody. No, Brody, don't. He's going to get really upset. You still have fish thrown all over the room, Brody. Back up. You better get your stuff. Brody, this is now. Hey, Brody. Brody. You want Legos? Take the ones down there. Come on, man. Don't get him all triggered. What's up, my man? See, I like this better. You come over here as soon as I saw you come up the stairs. <laughs> What's going on, Bego? Oh, he knows. This is now. Hands to ourselves. Come on. I get it. He doesn't want him to destroy stuff. Okay, that's it. No farther. Just wanted to check on the boys real quick. Look at this kid, man. Look at this kid. Look at all six cups. <laughs> Unbelievable, man. I know he didn't drink them all. Turn the fan down. It's cool. It's cooling off quick in here. Just turn this fan down and that one, or that one off. It's just, it's getting cold, man. Let's go see what they're up to. Beckham! I love Brody, too. How are you? Are you and Brody hanging out, watching TV? Oh, look how good you're being. Look, you got watching stuff about vitamins and stuff, huh? All right, just making sure you're being good boys. Brody, what can I do for you, sir? You ate all that spaghetti, too. Good. Unless I'm going to find it somewhere around the house. Good job, buddy. You guys ate all your food. I love it. You're watching shows, stimming. This is yes. We can probably shut some of these windows, too. Let's shut this one, though, in case it starts to rain. It said it was going to rain. It didn't rain, though. So, 70% uh, chance. Hi! You ate all that pasta. What you want from me? You want to take me somewhere, don't you? You want me to hug you? What's going on? You're holding my hand. What you need from me, sir? Oh, you want me to pick you up? Oh, oh God, you're so heavy. Where are we going? <laughs> you ready back here and do this again? <sighs> outside, yeah, we're not going outside. No, no, no. It's a bad, no, no. That's what I know. He just guided me to the window. He's like, no outside today, Bobo. No way, no. Not today, okay? He'll get there. Still got plenty of time. But this is, yes, you guys are being really good. I love it. Let's just crack this one. What's the temperature at now? I said it's getting cooled off. 74 feels cooler than that. All right. We're making good time today. Yeah, man, it's only 6.30. I mean, I got up there at 4.30, so. All right, I'm going back up. I'll see you kids in a moment. If you want to come hang out with Dad, you're welcome. You do your thing. Man, two years ago, none of that would exist. Took a long time to get a system like this in place. Daddy potty. Forgot about the asparagus. My pee is smelly. <laughs> smelly pee. All right, race go boom. Told him not to rip the soda thing. He just ran off with it, which I'm sure he's trying to start something here. Yeah, here, give me that. Thank you. May I have this, please? Thank you. This is you. Look how handsome you are. That's you. Oh, I know. You're having a meltdown here. I don't know what's going on. Okay. Okay. Oh, it's because he's drinking one of your water cups. No big deal. Take it easy, Brody boy. Bounce. Good job bouncing, Brody. Look at you bouncing. Yeah. You're in his space. You need to come back. Come on. Let's go. This is why he's melting down. He wants you out of here. Sorry. We're going to leave you alone. Okay. We're out. We're out. Okay. No. No Pringles. Those are bats. No. And you know not to take this to rip this. I told you already twice. Oh, this kid. Yeah, I just put it. I sit down. He takes it off and runs again. This is just, he's trying to get Brody to rip it apart. You're not funny. This is why you're not going to get to hang up pictures anymore. You think you're funny. You're not funny at all. It's ridiculous. I like those. He just ran off and tried to get, destroy those, but he failed. Tried to like wrinkle it up. And like, oh, Brody boy's having meltdowns. Oh boy. 
play a pretend with the helicopter? Sing it, baby boy. Honey bear, what do you see? Go ahead, sing. You were doing so good. Come on, everyone's watching, Beckham. Honey bear, what do you see? How's the song go? That's mommy's. I'm glad you like it, though. It's nice. Brody did a good job working on that in this class. Come on, you got any songs for us? With some lyrics. I want to hear some words, man. All right, he's being shy. <laughs> All right. Slow race tonight, so I gave the car a make over here. Let me race with it like it. I think it was cool. Little color, different colors. People know your car and it's not randy because you look like somebody else's car. Like I'm already grabbed most of the cops and threw them down. Oh, and Brody brought them back up. So we're doing that now. We got to go do doctor here. Mr. Uh, Beckham Man. Where you at, Mr. Beckham? I hear Brody. What you doing here, Brody boy? Yeah, real easy guy. We're done. We just chill. All right, my man. You ready for bedtime yet? Let me get your gummies here, okay? We're going to get a brother doctor here. Oh, we went in the dishwasher. That's cool. That's a big no. Stay out of the dishwasher. Not to mention it smells in there because we don't have the stuff yet. We can't wash the dishes. So don't go in the dishwasher. Whoever did that. These things are kind of washed when I throw them in there. But when the stuff sits on, it gets mold on. You know what I mean? Don't touch. This is now. This is now. Stay out of the dishwasher. Oh, you tired, Beckham? We gotta do doctor now. Oh, I love the starry sky here. Come on, let's go do doctor. Let's get you settled here. We can shut this all the way. It's getting real cold. What is that, airplane? Yeah, it's slowly dropping here. All right, let's get you doctor and let's get you in a pull up. Let's do real time here a little bit. Cause you didn't really film too much, and I don't think we did. Oh, you know, I always think I don't, and then next thing you know, it's over an hour long. So. Mom said she'll be at late, so taking my time. We'll race car boom up there. We'll play another half hour or so. And then we're going to. That's it. You're getting your gummies. Let me get the gummies first, actually, so that he doesn't ask for, uh, you know, F O O D. Take two of these. Call me in the morning. Here's your two. Um, I'm going to have you go put your pull up on first, and then I'll do insulin because I got to go potty myself here. We got time still. It's like 8 20 something. I'm trying to do it around 8 30. Here you go. Take two of these. Call me in the morning. School tomorrow. Let you hang out for a little longer. Here's your pull up right here. Back. Back. Baby boy. Back up. Back up. It's right here. Look. Put your pull up on. You're ready to go. Thank you. I forgot to lock the door. He's got to go potty. You got all the lights on here. I'll just let him go. Yeah, go potty first. That's good. Good job. We we'll waited. Brody, man, don't get comfortable, my man. It's time to go upstairs after this. You're not falling asleep down here because you already took your gummies. You needed help putting this on. It was one of those diapers. Ever get a diaper where they make it? It's falsely made and it's like, oh, Jesus, kid. You okay? Jesus, bro. <laughs> Clumsy. Where it was like stuck together and you couldn't get it on. All right, I got your medicine here. Let's get you insulin here. Let's go, harmonica, man. Check your level first here. All right, perfect level, buddy. He spotted an ant. You got good vision, man. I didn't see him. Look at him. He's chilling there. He said, I, I want all your crumbs and your stuff that you leave on the counter. Ready, brave man. Let's go. Brave. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. You did it. Good job. You're so brave. All right, TV off. Let's go. We're going to go upstairs. I'll fix it. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. It's all right. It's all right. When you push the button, watch, watch. I'll show you something. Look, when you hold this, sometimes it does that. You got to hold it. And then you're going to move it. See? It does like a move thing. See? That's all. No big deal. Now we hit it. Oh, we got to hold it on power off. That's all. He got confused. He got really upset really quick. All right. Good job. All right. Let's get up to bed here. Let's go. Bedtime. Cause that military is going to hit you and you're going to pass out. And I'm not having you fall asleep down here again. Well, you didn't fall asleep, but you laid down here. Let's go. Up the stairs, everybody move. Underlay, underlay, arriba. You got the water cups. Tell me you didn't touch the needle over here. 
Did I put the, where's the needle at? Crap. Where's the needle? Did he take the needle? Did I put it away already? Oh, I'm losing my mind. I usually put the one I just used away back. Oh, I did it. Okay. Losing my mind. So you get in such a routine, it's like, what's that thing called? You're an autopilot. <laughs> Man, they're going up easily for me. No arguments. Remember how we used to do two meals a night? How frustrating that was for dad? I had to slowly work into that routine with them and we've managed to do it. And they've accepted it. Because the meals before bed was too much. I was gonna have him come hang out with me, but I'd rather them just get used to going in bed early on school nights. What do we say before bedtime? You might need this tonight. I highly advise you use it. Where's the other one? Where's your blanket at? How do you not have two blankets up here? Oh, there it is. Bird boy, kill him. Because then he won't even know it's up. Oh, well, he's been sitting in that spot. Here you go. I love you. Sweet dreams. Whoosh. Yes, I will put mine as income. You guys are really good today. Thank you. Been really good days lately, man. Compared to what we were going through. Beckham starting too. Really get used to this routine and sticking with it. I like it. Yeah, it's maturing a little bit here and understanding emotions more. I'm not to, you know, how to handle them. It's getting good. Good job, Brody. All right, let's get Monster Zinc on for you since you've asked for it. Monster Zinc, volume 15. Beckham's already tucking himself in. You got your DJ equipment, both of you. You get some sleep. I love this. I love how you're on the trampoline with your ball, man. Put your blanket in there. Hoi! All right, boys, I love you. High five for today. Can you do it without? Oh, he's going to fall. I love this. All right, kids. Eventually, we'll try to get, like I said, I got to get the USB stick with movies on there. I'm getting there. Because if they ask for Monster Zinc and they're fine with it, it's a routine. And they're going to pass out anyway. But I'd like to give them more stuff. Migration and everything. All right, you go, Brody. Go, Brody. Go. Good job, Brody. And all the lights on the wall. It's good. Lots of stim in here. All right, kids, you guys were really good today. Thank you. I love you. Sweet dreams. But they don't need the fan in their time. Just gotta keep it out here. Just to keep the air pulling. I think it'll be too cold on them. All right, I'm gonna go back to this for a little while. Let's do more race couple of stuff. We'll go out there later. Oh, I gotta share the video. Oh, you guys have to wait a little longer. Sorry. Of course, we got kicked out because you know it took a while. Pick up a little bit here. Put this here for mom. So she sees it. She'll love this, Brody. Really well done, Brody, in the school. I love it. Like when he's trying to rip it apart. He's such a butthead, man. So bad. Just making the other car I drive here, too. So, you know, keep a theme going, man. It's the way you stand out more. You know, every car looks the same. They're always in a plain color. It gets to be frustrating. Because everybody smashes you over and over again because you look like that car. Now, let's see if we can get a race before uh, this controller dies because it's on its last breath here and I don't have a plug for this. Just the iPhone. It's up there. So... We gotta do this, something about that, Dad. This jerk off, IP777, I think that's his name, whoever the hell, oh wait, no, Notorious117, tried to make me just lose in this race, because he, he's a bitch. <laughs> I got first place, first race in with that car. But then, like, there's a lot of bums on there, these scrubs, man, like this guy, just circling around, waiting to ram people, it's just, it's just pathetic, bro. Get on, get on that, play the game, man. If you don't know how to play, then get the hell out of here. Every now and then it's funny, but just like, I get it. But like, ridiculous, man. Yeah, he's still sitting there just waiting to ram more people. Punk, I hope he leaves. I wanna play at least one more race, like one more, two more. I like that, first race in, we win, that's good. Make some money back that we just spent on the damn car. Again, just being, you know, that is what it is. The kid's like watching this, I like doing it. You gotta get a device to record this stuff. Oh, they don't show the car. There's no cat mask. Boo. Yeah, that was a good session, though. I like it. I like it. Some of these people were... I was first from the whole race, basically. Just, it's all weird. Kick that guy. Uh, I plugged this in for a second, and then I accidentally pulled it out. The controller. Ah, I just lost that session, man. I don't even know if they saved my window, man. Now that's beat. Ah, you know, man... All right, Mickey. I don't know where the remote is, Mickey. So you're out. You're out of luck tonight. I'm sure it's in the couch. Beckham always finds it. But uh, just did a little cleaning up here. His yes, blah blah blah. Uh, mom's not here, so the cat's upstairs still. So we'll be back later, I believe. Temperature to drop. Windows are all shut. Just the homework fan is blowing. I turned my fans off. Uh -oh. 
All right, we got this here for you, Mama. I love that good stuff, Brody. As yes, always. All right, we did our duties. Oh, I gotta unlock this freezer still too for Mom and myself. I gotta come back in. Uh, let's go show you this video because it's a new concern. I'm running, you know, just keeping my to myself. <laughs> All right, yesterday's video just went up. You see, we're in the backyard. Back on floating on this turtle raft. Oh, I love it. Not too bad. Around ten o'clock. Take your vitamins, Dad. The usual. Wool. Lots of vitamins. Here. Oh yeah. Ah, one advertisement that does suit me well. I like that. Kingdom of the Planet of the Apes, the new one. Ah, it's probably gonna be so good. I'm a big fan of that series, the new uh, remake. Oh, so good. Under the Moon, the usual. Stogie, Mixie. So, uh, just taking it easy, man. Relax and enjoying it while I can, man. I love how the we've had such a calm system these days. It's working really well. Proud of you, boys. Rescuers had to use chainsaws to remove them from what's left of their house. This morning, she's... Sitting here, as usual, watching the news, wrestling. Uh, it's like a little after 11. Uh, something I'd always tell you, I like, like to write, write a lot of little short stories or notes of uh, potential stories, and now more than ever because of AI and everything. I just had this vision of just like, for some reason I had <laughs> dreams, everything, I try to remember them, I'll even, in the middle of the night, like, let me write that down, because I like, forget it. Uh, but just now I just picture this, <laughs> this visual, because I go through the comments, sometimes people are commenting on my parents wrestling, and I was like, man, what I wouldn't give is just have AI. While my parents are arguing with all the rabbits on the table, my dad's screaming, and then just two death mattresses, there's like, boom, the match continues, just goes through the house while the <laughs> rabbits are on the table, <laughs> just like, <laughs> see what AI comes up with. Not yet. It's not really ready for all that, but you know, a decade from now, it's going to it, probably a year from now, two, five years tops. Maybe it's going to be so precise and un unbelievable. And like I keep saying and discussing with films and all that stuff, and I have a lot of friends that make films. I've even had people ask me to come in and help them out. And I, I know there's opportunities too. My own buddy makes films. Like I say, hey, let me go out there. I could be a character in your film, but what am I going to find time without a vehicle? That's the thing. But anyway. Plenty of time, only 42, remember, he's still young. 42 is the 32 today, right? You take your vitamins, you, you, you drink your protein shakes, get rid of the cigarettes. I know the scar's not the best solution, but slowly, but trust the process, man. My weight even has gone down, I'm taking those probiotics with the with the caffeine, green tea, and other stuff in there that keeps it, it keeps it down. And then just getting out in the sun the other day with the kids, just briefly, you notice the difference. My energy's been through the roof. The sun does something that makes your energy just so good. You feel so much better. It's amazing me all the time too. It's like stay out of the sun. You're gonna get cancer. This is the world we live in today, man. It's terrifying. Everything that is good for you that's told it's not for the most part. It, it, you need sun. I mean, your Irish skin. I can get it when you you got this freckles up. Just five minutes of it, a few minutes. And it's crazy because like the stuff that we're <laughs> put under to protect us from the sun was poisoning us. This is I mean you cannot trust anybody or anything. So you go and you do your own thing. I'm just sharing my day daily, man. My son's day is more than importantly, where we'll, they will be someday, and myself. And I think dad just added another 10, maybe 20 years on his life by getting rid of those cigarettes, man. I don't ever go back, I never will. Eventually I'll probably even stop smoking cigars, but the smoke's not going to my lung. The fan blowing this way, so the smoke, no secondhand smoke, because that's the one thing I was kind of like, oh, it's still getting in me, I'm like. But I was having like a little hit of mucus with black, smoking nothing. Clear as can be. Never felt better. Take your vitamins, trust the process, and do what makes you feel good. Not what everybody else tells you to do. I still can't get over that, man. <laughs> like, the sun is so bad for you. Stay out of the sun. You gotta put sunblock, sunscreen on you all day. My kids barely put it on them. In the beginning, when they're really pale white a little bit, they had such a good base tan. It's unnecessary, man. Why do you think the world, everybody's, uh, uh, our skin is different colors because of the sun and uh, our routines outside and everything. It's, it's the human body adapted to it. But if you're going to tell me that the sun is bad for my health, you're out of your fucking mind. And I know some people ha have problems with, 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 with skin cancer and stuff, but it's still skin cancer is a very rare form, man. And you see these people that are like in their 90s, like my dad's mother, she is in her 90s, bro. She lives in the sun. She smoked until about the age of, well, older than me. She was in the 50s something. That woman eats an all and takes care of her health. Eats right. And I haven't spoken to her God knows how long since I was a little kid. I randomly ran into her when the kids were first born and all that stuff. And family functions when the family dies and all that stuff. But 
she's a living example. The sun is good for you. I think she survives skin cancer. I don't know. Because my parents never kept up with, with their parents. So I didn't get to really talk to my grandparents. It sucks. I only got to see them at the weddings and all that stuff. And again, I'm getting into it and whatever. But anyway, you do you. Do what makes you happy and how you feel good. Now we just got to get a laminator. I think it'd be fun to do that with the arm accent and just maybe develop a character. Something the kids create and make like a whole mask of laminate thing. I am the laminator. Who do you want to do? Want to do? Do. <laughs> just to be goofy and weird, something different on the channel. Because I know it's, it can be very boring here. I know you guys aren't like, oh, look at this, this routine of their boring life of kids get on the bus and then dad playing video games now like a jerk off. <laughs> couldn't be more proud of them. You see how the simplistic stuff, less is more with them. I don't want to overstimulate their minds or, you know, their hearts because that stuff can stress them out all the uh, same time. You know, as they get older, when they're old men someday, they got to have a balance. I don't know about it. There might be a way to uh, resolve what's going on with autism. Who knows, man? But again, is it a, a wallet? Who knows, man? My kids are the sweetest, loving little dudes ever, and I'm more proud of them. If you guys see this when you're older someday, or at the nowhere, I don't know if the video still exists on YouTube. And I'm all gone. I love you dearly. You guys are my dudes. I know you are doing well, and you're happy and loved. Uh, and I will miss you in the turning and beyond. That gets me to because one day that won't be right. I love you, boys. All right, we'll come back and then nonsense, Dad. It's always your favorite. One day I'm just going to start acting and pretend like I'm sitting at the dinner table. So you can place me on like a, <laughs> a vertical monitor and sitting with, with yourself like, eat your vegetables, boy. <laughs> All right, take care. Nonsense, Dad. I'll be back. The one thing that's like missing is the whale. Need the whale raft. Let's end this vlog and just do a thing. As I like watch, start to watch last night's video. As for the real adults out here, uh, when you sip on the, the booze, you don't remember what the hell you talked about. And again, real talk here, man. That's, that is what it is, man. Smoking a cigar, the second one of the night. It is what it is. I had so many thoughts of things. I'm glad I, I, I discussed a little brief moment there while I was like sober. And then the emails were like, yo, get rid of the booze and all that stuff. And then the individuals that, that still sit the booze at night, uh, it's not that bad when you do like a, a, like a nightcap at night. Um, but it is a, a balance. Uh, like I said, one step at a time. I cut the cigarettes off, but like, what's more worse for the body, uh, the alcohol or the tobacco? I'm gonna say right now, through my uh, body's familiar uh, situations, it's definitely the tobacco. Get rid of the cigarettes. As much as I was like, oh, I roll these things, but you're damaging your 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 cardiovascular system where you'll run and all that stuff but like um and the moms and the the individuals that mess with me like get back on the the beta blockers with myself having a heart condition since like 2005 um i feel great as long as i take that vitamin c and potassium and all the other stuff that's it's involved take take your pills man but again, it wouldn't hurt to have that, but it's, I'm trying to like see what my body needs, man. Cause there's gonna be a time where I, can, I can't get this stuff poss possibly. So when I see Beckham um, and her mom and all that stuff, when she, she was luckily unfortunate enough, Beckham was luckily unfortunate enough to have a uh, mom with a workplace has a system where she can get all that stuff f for, for Beckham. But again, I'm, I'm gonna say here, if I make too much money, my son cannot be taken care of uh, medically. It's it's so fucking. It, I'm a curse. It's so fucked up, dude. 
but uh, I'm ready to reapply and all that stuff. And like I said with him, he, he's he, Beckham's got to get on that uh, disability shit like his brother's got down. The as I'm cursing, I don't care. The shit I went through with the phone calls and all that stuff in the school system. Luckily, we had a good uh, guidance counselor and also they 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 helped me with Brody. So man, they're giving me the runaround. They're telling me that, that Brody is not uh, an autistic child and all that stuff. And this man sent the whole paperwork to him. So now I think with the with the report that recently came back, if it was IP or EP or whatever it had, whatever the initials are, I don't know. That's a part that confuses it, as myself. But Beckham needs it, man. And and the mom too, I keep telling her, I was like, dude, you gotta help me with this stuff. Yeah, she doesn't, so it's it's up to me to do all this stuff. Beckham needs to be officially diagnosed as an autistic child. You see him every day. He's like, ah, I love, I think it's it's, it's so beautiful. And was it? Ah, he's like a cockatoo. And also, I love that, man. He's my dude, man. But the one of I got when, hold on a second here. Just to get Brody that, man. They were trying to tell me, because uh, we all know Social Security is going to run out, which I get. As I went through this in the past, uh, I, I didn't stick with it for myself, but I'm, I'm not disabled like like Brody is. Like When you see Brody, when it's like he throws his dirty clothes into the trash or he doesn't understand things, he, he's disabled. He's a disabled child. And Beckham, too, is as well with things. He's a disabled child too, with his IP, IP, EP, whatever the hell the, the initials are. Um, I gotta get on this stuff with that man. Uh, Cause in the long run, um, if I am on, on my own with them, if, if God forbid something ever happened to her mom, or she was sick or something, like, I gotta be there for them. And nobody's dipping into this and, and helping us. It's a frustrating part, man. It's like I said again. I'm thankful for the online villager we have here. Uh, th through the mothers and the fathers, but also the kids that, that are still currently caring for their kids, and the ones that are just going through life uh, on their own at, at, as they lost their their child at a very uh, younger time in their life. Um, my heart goes out to all y'all. I'm just, just thankful every day for all y'all. And then, uh, uh, boy, through Nick over here, I'm going to say again, you are the dude, man. You have, have, have showed me so much, man. I kind of went through the emails tonight, but I, I, I didn't keep up with it. But uh, you're willing to send another care package. I just jam, dude. Like, I just hope that you never go out of your way too much where you, you are taking care of my kids more than you're taking care of yourself because i know you've told me that you're taking care of your grandmother with dementia that's what i mean like there's gonna be a situation one day where you may have dementia or i could have dementia i, I don't know man um i know through these videos too that you can learn too the fish oil all, all these vitamins that can be beneficial to you man it is it is life is a big old nonsense bs man i'm just this world in general and i try to keep it consistent and like a professional <laughs> just i don't know just everything's so chaotic today man uh as i'm like backing up the kids videos and other stuff and i'm i'm trying to think ahead of times when there, there could be like a couple months ahead where it's just like cool you can't have any of your internet access. Uh, as I was discussing with their mom and stuff too, with TV shows and stuff. And uh, like I said last night, she, she came back, just hung out with me. It's nice to have that. Her, her friend, John, just got the, the, the cut the kid's hair, just got engaged. And you know, we're like, oh. You should be with it now, man. <laughs> it's interesting. It's, it's funny. 
I, I don't want to be with anybody. I want, I want to be with my kids and their main goals and their focus and stuff. Um, but again, just trying to balance myself out and what I'm going to go through. Uh, if, if mom was ever like, you, you can't be here again because she has that choice, it's, it's tough, man. It's even mental health stuff. It's, it's tough. And I told her the other day, um, she's never going to watch this, but I said, you, you remind me of my mom so much, Rebecca. I was like, I hate saying this, but I was like, you got the cats. They're crapping all over your bedroom, and you keep continuing to take care of them. And then you came out, and after you came back from work, and I said, she, she was like, why is that fan in the hallway? Why isn't it in their bedroom? And I said, I looked at your face. It's like, you had that look like, whoa. Uh, that's mental health stuff that, that people just go to. You, uh, she has no control over it. She's a really good woman, like a really good person. But uh, through genetics and other stuff, just just like with anything. just That's the way it is, man. This is like now like 12.30 at night. And then uh, I enjoy all the conversations I get from uh, everybody here. And especially <laughs> the special needs community uh, that are possibly want, want to date. Date dad. Can you imagine just going on a date? <laughs> I promise I'm, I'm no good for you, man. <laughs> That's what I told their mom too. And she asked me a serious question. And I was like, well, whatever happened with all of us? Like, why, why couldn't you just come to bed at a reasonable time? And also, I was like, first of all, the bedroom smells like cats and all that stuff. That's no to me. I said, I grew up in an environment where the house was filled with bunny rabbits. Do you not understand any of this stuff? She didn't. So, immediately after the house fire, too, I said, I'm not going to sleep in here anymore. And I started to slowly create... Uh, the bedroom that I'm at now, and then the kids share a bedroom. But she's like, oh, I just don't get. It. I was like, I can't, I can't sleep in a bedroom where it smells like cat shit all the time. I'm sorry, just no. It's just, this is a no to me, man. And then through the dating apps and all stuff, and I've met a lot of nice uh, women here, just conversations and stuff. But I feel like I should switch the whole profile. Say, I think I just said like. Just like it. the only thing I'm looking for is just like a friend or just like that's it like I, I don't see how you could be part of my life unless you, you're you related uh, understand the situation with, with autistic kids especially these kids this one woman that I adore dearly uh, she has a ch child that suffers goes through mental retardation and she's got a th fucking mind dude and she's the same boat as I am. We're going to say, how's your day? She's like, oh, shit. She gives me a thumbs up, thumbs up. We do the thumbs down, thumbs up. Um, she's got a lot going on for her. And uh, I salute her dearly. It's just like, damn. Man, no families out there helping her. Nobody. And then when the people with the dating app thing, it's like, oh, Facebook thing. Damn it. But they're like, is this what you're going to do for the rest of your life? Is just like play video games and all? No, absolutely not. A lot of shit I do on the side. I don't share all that stuff. Except for the, this is the wing ball footage I just sent with somebody else. Uh, and the Japanese TV shows and stuff. I, I do my own thing. I like to keep to myself. I do. But it bums me out because at the same time, when you, when you think about mental health, this is like that person, myself, is like not doing well if they're not willing to interact with another human being. That's bullshit, dude. I'd rather figure out things potentially with like making films and all that stuff as AI is going to be the most easily accessed thing. Uh, I don't know, man. I just, I just, I get exhausted on stuff. But again, uh, the best part is like, you all, the mom that's going through her stuff with her mentally challenged child, uh, 
she's on her own, which is bullshit. She's a really beautiful woman inside and out. You deserve so much more. Um, Pain in the butt, so. <sighs> but anyway, I don't know. I don't know what else to say. I've been keeping it so simplistic here, but it's working with the routine here. As less is more. Visual therapy as they watch themselves. Like I'm upstairs playing the video game up there. I'm just raising cars, and they're down there watching themselves, and they're laughing. I'm like, what's going on down here, kids? Because you look back in the past, two years ago, what I didn't have all the locks and all that shit, it wasn't working, man. If, if you, whether you have a child that elopes or shit, or uh, just kids in general that they're not going to listen, locks and locks and locks. Spend the, the $300 on all the locks in the cabinets. Don't get those cheap child locks of like 50 bucks for all the 12 of them. Just, just pay the full price at once. Because they're going to break them in half. You see how happy they are, and I, I just can't thank uh, anybody here that is like, uh, uh, true and again, like just send the, the green ball bounce on it, and I love that, man. They don't know what they're doing, man. They're just little baby boys, man. But again, at the same time, I got I got to think of things where. If if mom's mental health isn't like fully hundred percent, like again, like discuss the mom here where uh, she's doing a lot with her mentally challenged child, and she's on her own, and that husband just bailed completely. Um, you got you got to figure out a system, man. And I miss the. Uh, place I would stay at with the, the little girl that was there she, she's the shit she's such a good good kid but I gotta focus on my sons first and again this is I guess we say it's don't take life too seriously give a shit man it's all a big joke dude uh, we're a science experiment uh, my opinion is always gonna be that that's a hair birdie up there stomping just like doing like uh simultaneous like just I feel like we were <laughs> we were at other planets probably Mars get jazzed to Mars and then we're here now the life is a shit show just go with the flow but uh and again, too, like I told the mom, I said, hey, if, if you have the differences with, with myself, uh, myself staying here, then you take the kids the half of the time. Uh, and that basically shut her up pretty quick. I said, I'm going to stay here. You're wrong. You, you're not going to have me walking back and forth. Because I was, like, literally risking my life. Hey, it sucks because, like, young younger kids today, they don't understand. They just go go hard. Like, I went through shit with lighters, like, lighting cigarettes people one night. Like, I don't know. It's hurtful. Um, it's this summer. They're only seven, eight now, but this summer they're going to be eight, nine. Um, Dad's always going to be there to take care of you. I'm going to make sure we're good. Um, but I'm overwhelmed as a parent doing it on his own. Um, it shouldn't be like this at all, should it? It should be like there should be families living in one home and everything, and everybody getting along. And it's like, okay, I gotta go away for like an hour. Let me walk to Wawa to get hoogies for the boys, their mom, their grandmother, my mom, and she was around and to do all this stuff, my dad, it's just not there. So this this is a system I came up with with them. And I always test the waters. And they're like, how the, how the hell have you managed to just like leave them unsupervised? This is why. Because you spend the money on the, on the locks and all that stuff and you just do it. It, it sucks. Because for the most part, uh, Beckham wants to come up upstairs and do all that stuff. And I feel like as I look at Brody, 
I need to find a system for Brody because Beckham has the the race car race car boom or just like the the Lego stuff. But if we can figure out a thing with, with Brody, where he can have it, where he's not like drinking water from the cups and spitting all over the place, we can have that. And again, it's just like. TJ, be selfish. Just, just disappear and do that. No, absolutely fucking not, dude. My dudes are my dudes, man. Brody Beckham, you guys are the most uh, loving, interesting individuals in my life. And that ain't going no way. <laughs> Anywhere, though. No. It's always fun <laughs> to, besides, like, the people that, that don't, uh, W, the people that I grew up with, they're like, why don't you just go out there and do whatever the hell you want to do? I'm doing what I want to do. I'm spending it with my kids. But like, why don't you go out and go binge drink and all stuff? I just... <laughs> I don't know, man. This is the... <laughs> I found a system that works, and, and I'm going to continue to work with it. And, uh... And then the, the bunker people to it all. It's, oh, you guys are so interesting. I just love it. I love it, dude. I don't, I, there's one of the, the individuals here that watches this channel. He's an old head. Old school head, dude. Uh, I'm not going to mention your name, so don't get mad at me. But uh, you're in like your 60s or 70s. You lost your kids. You always pass away, you have a bunker, and you invited myself to your bunker. I said, yo, that, that uh, I love. I would love to do a, a visual uh, vlog of just attending the bunker and seeing all that stuff. It's so cool, dude, that you were uh, so nice and in tune with, like, with my kids and all that stuff. I just love it, man. I, I think it's so interesting. I... I <laughs> <laughs> Again, it's like a real one. It's like I love it, dude. Man, I'm gonna puff on the cigar, do my thing, and just uh, do whatever the hell I want to do. What's best for the kids, man? What the hell is this thing, though? Man, these are Cubans, Jerry. Cubans. What I would love to do is joke around with their mom more often. <laughs> to keep her into reality because <laughs> it's a reality check man cubans jerry cubans yeah. <laughs> she's like i said something there the other day she's like what do you mean cubans jerry i said kramer you can't have cubans here you you can't just have cubans did you actually mean cubans or cubans <laughs> she's like and I'm working like on a 60 terabyte hard drive with all the backup footage and also the visuals of the kids' footage and all that stuff. Just keeping it backed up, man. I don't know, man. Just do what you got, though. I don't know. The stuff with like my buddies making a film and all that stuff. Just, I love that, man. I love the kid. I do want to film, man. Yeah, I'm rambling on, man. It is just life, dude. Time is it? Uh, stop judging, stop loving, except this. Right? I know, I know, I have a lot more to say. Treat the kids the way you want to be treated as kids, at least best you can. And just go with the flow, man. But I, I get tired of all the BS, man. Take care, everybody. Go love yourselves. Go love yourselves. Pants.